Yo, what's going on? It's your boy Kimmo. Welcome back to another video. As you guys can see, we have rank three foot champs rewards. Unfortunately, we couldn't get the back to back rank one. Man, this champs was very, very sweaty. We lost three games in a row, which was kind of mad. We actually started off nine and zero, oh, and then we ended up twelve and one, and then we lost three in a row, and we ended up twelve and four. And it was a tough, tough time. Um, I feel like we played against a lot of good players. Don't get me wrong. However, it was a couple lucky goals here and there from our opponents, but. Yeah, I think it could have gone either way. Maybe if we played them on another day, we would have won those games. But uh, it's, it's one of them ones. It was kind of like a 50-50 even game. And then they kind of just let it slip at the end. Uh, but this is the team that we did end up using. We got this Chua Mini card who looks absolutely incredible. And he is pretty good as well. Uh, he did impress me because I did use him in Rivals. And I didn't think anything special. However, he is a lot better um, now that I've used him a lot more. Uh, but yeah, everything else pretty much stayed the same. We had Rolfo in midfield instead of Bruno Fernandes. Who's better, Bruno or Rolfo? It's a tough one, but I think I think Bruno is still better than Rolfo. I just think like Bruno is just a lot more aggressive in game. Um, and obviously, he's got the aggression stats compared to Rolfo. And yeah, upgraded Jao Felix was good. Everyone else was good. Socrates played as an attacking centre mid. And on the battle, we bought on the battle, um, who was very, very good. I think she's actually the best right back in the game. So I'm very, very impressed with her. I am going to sell her as well. I do, need, I, need, I do need to make sure I need to sell her because I don't want to lose coins on um, my players. But yeah, very, very good team overall. However, don't know what happened, man. Don't know what happened. Matchmaker was quite tough. All right, first 84 plus player pick. And we get ourselves an inform. Uh, we're going to go for the inform and we're going to quick sell recover probably. Uh, next 84 plus. Okay, nothing special. We've got an 85 back to back. Last 84 plus. Can we see a good player potentially? Okay, we've got two informs. We'll take Hutchinson again. But like I said, guys, we've got three 85s. But now we've got the 87 plus campaign. Last week, we got Schneider, Fantasy Hero, which was a very, very nice car to get. This week, who are we going to get? First one. Brolin, Matson, Pacho, and Politano. We're going to go with Brolin. Um... Not a bad card, but I have used them. I did pack him on tradable earlier when fantasy was going on. Not bad, but nothing special. And the next one, can we see a big boy? Yaya Torre, maybe? No. Okay, that was a terrible one, to be honest. We'll go with Molina. We'll go with Molina. Um, we'll quick sell recover this Falcone. And let's head on over into the pack. So hopefully we can get something good. And um, yeah, first 100k pack. We get ourselves... Luka Modric, is it going to be a double walkout? It's not going to be a double walkout, so we'll skip it. So Luka Modric in the first one. Uh, I think we have him already. Yeah, we do. So we'll do that and we'll quick sell the rest. So at least we got a walkout. It's nice to see walkouts in these packs, even though it's nothing crazy. Uh, second one, this is going to be the ultimate pack and it's going to be Jamaican striker. So yeah, I mean, not even a walkout. That's an 85, I believe. Um... Yeah, 85 rated. How much are 85s anyway? 5k? can sell her, I guess. Um, everyone else can get quick sold. So yeah, unfortunately, nothing from these packs. But maybe in these ones, we can get something good. 85 double. No foot birthday. I feel like the pack weight for this foot birthday team is a lot worse compared to last week. And it's not even a double walkout. So we get Donnarumma, 87 rated, who we already have. And Trippier, who we already have as well. And the last one... The last one, 85 times 3. No foot birthday again. It's going to be Luka Modric back to... Can we get a double walkout, please? No double walkout. Oh, my God. This is crazy. This is absolutely crazy. And, um, yeah, I guess we didn't get anything good here. Let me just quickly check uh, the objectives because I think we may have gotten a good pack from objectives. Okay, so these are potentially better packs. 83 times 5. We get a foot birthday. It's going to be Dutch Striker and it's going to be Dan Juma, who we've packed about five, six times already since the promo's been out. All right, so we put Dan Juma into an exchange so um, so we can keep him at least. And I'm not going to open an exchange on this video, to be honest. Uh, 84 times 4. Can we see a big boy? No, it doesn't seem like it. It's going to be English. We're going to skip it. If that's Harry Kane, that's decent. It's not Harry Kane, unfortunately. Uh, we'll keep daily or we'll sell daily um, and we'll quick sell the rest. We still have some decent packs, guys. So we've got 85 times 3 and 83 times 10. We're going to open up the 83 times 10 first. I know it's more players, but it's lower rated. 
and we don't normally get walkouts from this sometimes. Well, yeah, this is who's that? Milinkovic Savage. What's his rating? 86. I don't know how Milinkovic, Milinkovic Savage is still 86 rated. He is finessing the EA system. All right, last pack. 85 times three. Can we see something good? Nothing good, unfortunately. It's going to be French. It's going to be goalkeeper. And it's going to be Mike Manian. Is it a double walkout? At least we see a double walkout because we, we haven't even seen a double walkout today. And who is it going to be? It is going to be Pop. All right, we'll take it. We'll take the fodder because there are some decent SBCs out at the moment. And, uh, yeah, if you guys did enjoy this video, then please do leave a like, comment down below what you want to see next. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.